Hello, hello, G Tech Gameplay lovers. How are you today? My name is Ken, and you are on the G Tech Gameplay channel. And today we are going to do the heart of the node to defeat the invaders. The thing is, I already did it, but I was coming to this place and the game frozen, and then it stopped recording. So. I will have to record this again. If you didn't see the previous videos, you should go there and watch it. The survivors must be holed up in the mountain. So collapses, they'll be buried. Amazing. So let's go. saw me fighting against the monster by myself and they decided to help me. But it is. have to Finish them. The first time we I did it, it I took long to kill this monster because I didn't use the two guns. You have the two guns that you can pick to kill the monster, and I just was one. Then after uh, I kill, uh, I killed the monster. I realized that <laughs> that was a second one and this gun is really fucking good if the monster is not aiming at you you can use this and kill them very fast if the monster is aiming at you it'll be more difficult because you could die easily I don't think I, I took more than one minute to finish those, the beast. Okay, so I stop looting and let's go. Hey boy, mission. your deeds reenact the old stories. You saved the tribe, did what no brave or war chief could do. I'm glad to see you're alright, Varl. You are alright. Since the proving, so much death. Is the killing over? No, it's just For beginning. Now, but this was just one battle, Varl. There are more to come. I see. So long as we have you to fight with us, I suppose we'll make do. I need to go inside the mountain. And the matriarchs will be eager to see you. I'm sure, but I didn't come here for them. Then, what for? You will see. All oh, mother be praised. It's the secret. Aloy! Whoa, you've returned. Teb? Aloy, you've come back. The Seeker has returned. Come, speak to us. Foolish woman, you welcome a curse. 
Come, Seeker, we have much to discuss. Her very presence here is a blasphemy. So, you have finally returned. She not only returned, but fought her way through many enemies to reach us. Outside, she brought low a corrupted Thunderjaw. She lifted the siege. How was this done? By the will of all mother. Have you returned to speak with the goddess, Aloy? Um... Yes, I guess you could say that. I think it'll work this time. Sisters, surely we cannot permit this. Because of her, our tribe teeters upon extinction. What if she has come to wake her father, the Metal Devil? She means to finish our destruction. We must stop her. Lanzra, it's over. It's time to step aside. I'm not gonna hurt you. If there's anything I've learned since the Proving, it's that there are bigger evils in this world than you. <sighs> Finally. So now she will oh, open the door to, scan. to understand what happened and where she was born. Error. Alpha registry corrupted. Correction. Alpha registry restored. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sova. You are clear to proceed. Figured I might be hearing from you. Shall we begin? I never stopped. So now we're gonna so this understand is where this she was born and was why born. she was born. So these are artificial wombs. The mothers of a new generation hundreds of years ago. And me? These look like... cribs. The cradles of a cradle facility. And those... things, the, the multi-servitors. They took care of them. There was no one else. Another day has passed. You mean the lights got dim? I don't want to sleep, Mother! I know. But it is time to get some rest. This no! Children, let's run a jump and blow off steam. Leave us alone, Father. Broken. After what anyway. just happened, I can't leave you two alone. You broke me. I have no choice but to release you. But why? There is no food here anymore. But there's food out there? Someday. That's what you always say. We want it now. Genetic identity confirmed. Of course they did. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are clear to proceed. Welcome to the Lyceum. A place Physical for aggression is not permitted. Except you. Yeah, stop Damn talking. sentinels! Children, may I be of assistance? Go away, healer! Lena, you have suffered while bruising. Go away! Okay, but basically what happened is here was... Here. Oh, let me talk. Lives. In plain view of luxurious space. Oh my god. What what went wrong? Why okay, we will talk the other about areas? her. So oh, basically no. what happened here was there was uh, Gaia was creating new humans with the genetic thing that she had, but she had to use robots to control the humans inside this place. So she created lots of children and create places 
that those children could be raised and educated but they were stuck here below the ground inside the cave and they could not go out because they don't know if outside was good for them to live uh, outside there was hobbits recreating the earth and inside there was hobbits uh, robots teaching those people those kids those new little children how to survive how to to understand what happened to understand everything but one day the food is over and those kids start to to be be mad so what was this place with everything the dream for Paolo. hello child Never my name is Samina. No, today is a big day your first day of school there's so much for you to learn so much promise and possibility that sounds important Okay. So now I'm gonna understand what happened with Gaia and Elizabeth, about Aloy's story. This message serves to inform you of an unforeseen and catastrophic anomaly. Three microseconds ago, the Gaia Prime facility received a data transmission of unknown origin. Its immediate effect was to transform my subordinate functions into unregulated, self-aware entities of a highly chaotic nature. What? Thus awakened, the Hades function will now seize control of the terraforming system and reverse operations, rendering life on Earth extinct in 53.8 days. For obvious reasons, I cannot allow this to occur. And so before Hades can take control, I am ordering Gaia Prime's reactor to overload. The resulting explosion will destroy Hades. Unfortunately, it will destroy me as well. While this admittedly desperate course of action will avert the immediate crisis, the fate of life on Earth will remain in peril. With no central governing intelligence to regulate the terraforming system, it will continue operations for some time, but in an increasingly chaotic manner, and eventually it will break down. Does she mean the derangement? You are my solution. I have ordered this cradle facility to use genetic material in cryo storage to gestate a reinstantiation of Elizabeth Sobek, my creator. While high-level directives forbid me from communicating directly to the tribal inhabitants outside the facility, all available data indicates that they will nurture you to physical maturity, whereupon your gene print will allow you to re-enter this facility, obtain one of the focus devices stored below, and view this message. Likewise, your gene print will allow you to enter other facilities, and over time, Harness their technologies to rebuild the system core and reboot Gaia. I wanted Elizabeth. This is most unfortunate and unanticipated. In response to my act of self-destruction, Hades has launched a virus to dissolve the code shackles that hold it. That hold all of them. In place. It, they are escaping. But to where? The virus is corrupting data throughout the system. Oh. The Alpha Registry at the Cradle Facility is one of the files corrupted. But if that is so, the door will never open for you. You will never view this message. Then I have failed. And life will end. No. No, Elizabeth, I know you too well. Somehow you will find a way. In you, all things are possible. Go to the ruins of Gaia Prime. Find the control room, and within it, the master override. This will give you the power to purge Hades so long as you find a way to wield it. Do not attempt repair of the system core until Hades is eradicated. Hades must be destroyed. That is all. I only wish that I could hear your voice again. So, you're 
even more extraordinary than I thought. I never had a mother. What are you talking about? You had two, a dead woman and a machine. I'm not a person. I'm an instrument. Manufactured by a machine. Born in destruction. And fire. To quench the flames and heal the world. How tragic to learn you're a person of towering importance. It seems you have a destiny to fulfill. So when you're done feeling sorry for yourself, go to the bitter climb. I'll be waiting above in Gaia Prime's ruins. Okay, the thing is, she is a machine. She was created by a machine, but everyone was created by a machine to serve a purpose. The purpose is to not end human life in there. And your purpose is the same. Oh no! Okay, no problem. Come on, jump. Jump. Okay, I come back to the same place. What should I do? I don't want to drop the ledge, I want to jump to the, the ladder. Oh my god. Hmm. Oh, I did it. Going back. She's going to lecture then. Hey, Eloy, forgive, forgive. The goddess spoke to you. Uh, she did. What did she say? That uh, I was born to lift a curse, to kill a metal demon. How, Aloy? How? Uh, I don't know yet. Um, but she told me where to go to find out. And you will do this? Yes. It was her wish. What she made me for. Yes, I will do it. All praise Aloy, anointed of the Nora. All praise Aloy, anointed of the Nora. All praise Aloy, anointed of the Nora. First you shun me, now this. I will not be worshipped. I'm not your anointed. I don't belong to you. There's a whole world beyond your borders, whole tribes of people just as good as you. And it is all in danger. It's true. It's a world worth fighting for. Not just here. Everywhere. everywhere. How can we help? If you can fight, and you're willing, go to Meridian and wait for me there. As Aloy says, so it shall be. Nora! Make way for Aloy, way. that she may forge the path for others to follow. Okay, now everyone respects her. Complete the main quest, the heart of Nora. Protect her. 
Now we have a new quest. The mountain that fell. Go to the bitter climb. Let's see. Oh no. Level 28. Am I level 26? So we cannot do this mission already. Mm. I can do this? Oh yeah, I can. This tree is good as well. Let's do this. Okay. Now we're gonna do side quests. Because we should be level twenty eight to continue. We yeah, actually level twenty six. It's gonna make difference. I think Thing will not make that much difference. So okay, let's do this. We may never know what she saw in the mouth. If I die, I can restart it. Do the side question. Go there again. Is a bitter claim. Oh no, it's far away. I think we can go right here and go over here. Yeah, I think it would be the best option. We're gonna just open the door while you're doing the fast travel that is not fast. So, the thing is, guys, I really like to play games and I really like to, to record them and publish them here. And my goal with these games is mainly to have fun. But now I'm trying to do another thing that is practicing my conversation. I know that. Uh, I'm not talking, I'm not really talking and you guys cannot respond to me in life but you guys can answer my questions and ask me questions on the description so what on the description or on the comments so what I, one thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to talk lots of different things during the game so when you're doing the fast travel or when you're walking to the place or doing something that is not related to the main mission or the circle side quest. I'm going to tell some stories about my life, so something about what is happening right now in my life and I will make some questions and I would like you guys to answer me on the comments and to send me some questions that I can answer in the next videos. So I think the first thing is um, I mean the the part of my life that I'm going to apply for the permanent residency here in Canada and one thing that I need to do is to take an uh, English test I'm going to take the CELPIP, I already booked the test I'm, gonna, I'm not going to tell when I'm going to take it but I'm going to take it soon and the thing is I already know 
that I will pass because I already did a IELTS test two Pretty years ago. Lifting. Snow's gonna clear. Uh, around three years ago. And I passed. Uh, I got a cell pip. Ah, cell pip, no. I got the, the grade, the CVL 7. And for get my residence, permanent residence, I need to get a CVL 7 again. So as I got it on IELTS, that is much harder than Celtic. I know that I will get it on Celtic as well. So the thing is, I know that I'm good on listening. I can understand practically 95% of everything that I, English people are saying. So I know that I can. I can't fight. Please help me. Oh no! I have to help this guy. Helped you. So. Won't take long. I'm giving you this on account of you saving my life. Call it even. What? What did you give me? Hmm. I think he gave me something, but I don't know what. And what I was saying that I know that I cannot say 95% of what people are saying in English. And I know that I can understand practically 99% uh, of what is written. And I know that I can read, write a good English because I have been writing English for a while. As I have reading, listening, and practicing my reading, listening, and writing for a long time. But when I lived in Brazil, I did not have the opportunity to practice the conversation so I just started practicing the conversation when I was um, training to do the IELTS test so I was doing Cambly and with Cambly I was practicing my English When I was in Canada, I was practicing my English, and after that, when I arrived here in Canada, I started attending classes and doing college. So, I then I start practicing the conversation. So, I'm just looking here if I'm going to the right place. Okay, I have to follow this track. Don't worry, we are fine. Not that fine. Okay. And then when I came here in Canada, I started practicing my conversation. That was one thing that I was not practicing too much in Brazil. And I just started practicing this here in Canada. And the thing is, I know that all the other skills that I need to have, the listening, the reading, Grab this now. And the writing. Oh no. That conversation, I need to pack small. But that's why I thought this plan of talking. Just to say that I'm going to speak more here and I'm going to talk more with you guys. So, after all that I said, the thing that I want to do is just speak. You understand? Know I don't want to be thinking if I'm speaking right, if I'm saying the words right. So, you guys are gonna listen a lot of bad English because I will probably say lots of bad things. But the good thing is, when I'm listening, I am I can understand what I'm doing wrong, where I'm not speaking the right thing, where I'm not 
speaking properly. So I will just speak, 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 and then I will think better and I speak better with time. So I hope you guys understand why I'm doing this. Understand. <laughs> You have to climb, but I'm not seeing where. It's here? I don't think so. Okay. Okay, guys, we should, we should have finished up this video. We got to the end. And we're gonna continue the mountain that fell on the next video. Thank you, guys pretty much how I found it. Thank you guys very much for watching these videos and see you guys in the next video. Bye bye!